para dibujar cosas y lo tiene que estar picando todo el día. ¿Por qué no ha visto las flores que tengo? Ya me imagino. Sí, mi, con mi hermana nos pusimos a pintar y las florcitas y las piedritas. ¿Lo que en ¿Ah? ¿Lo que en teacher? ¿Qué? No, ¿qué? No, ¿qué? No, ¿qué? No, ¿qué? Uh, I'm not showing you. I'm not going to show you my bed. <laughs> <laughs> But I have a lot of flowers. <laughs> By the kindergarten. Right present in the chat, please, everybody. Right present in the chat. Write it, write it, please. Hello, Emperatriz. Hello, Rebecca. Hello, Hello teacher. Hey, welcome to another class. Rosa, hello. Ever, good evening. Hello, hello. teacher. Hey, welcome, guys, to another class. Welcome, welcome. Write present in the chat, please. Write it, write it. Okay, so what do you remember from the last class what did we study let's see let's see if you remember the alphabet the alphabet very good yes what else verb to be the verb to be okay what about the question that we studied what was the question that we studied in last in the last class uh, what is the question repeat please Question. What was the question that we studied? Affirmative and negative. Affirmative and negative with the verb to be. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. But when you want to ask me about the spelling of my name, what is the question? Let's see if you remember. How do you spell? That's right. Very good, Everett. How do you spell? How do you spell that word? How do you spell your name? That is something that we studied in the last class. And that's why we were studying the alphabet because we needed, we needed to practice the alphabet. So now we are going to practice a little bit the alphabet one more time. So Ever, choose one person ever in the class. Um. Eric Quinteros. Eric Quinteros. Okay, thank you so much. Eric Quinteros. <laughs> Tell us the alphabet in English. The uh, alphabet. The alphabet. The alphabet in English. Yes. Oh, A B C D C E N T E U. L A A O P Q R. Eric Quinteros. <laughs> oh my god, what is that? <laughs> okay, hey, ¿Qué ¿Qué va, va dos puntos, ¿Qué okay. <laughs> ¿Por qué, Eric didn't say the alphabet. Okay. We are going to choose another person. Rebecca, do you want to tell us the alphabet in English? Yes. Okay, tell us. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, A, M, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, J, C, C. Okay, X, Y, Z. X, Y, Z. That's right. Good, Rebecca. Two extra points for you. Good. <laughs> <laughs> the one that Eddie didn't get are for you. <laughs> okay. okay. So, Sulma, in the last class, we studied the alphabet. We were talking about the alphabet, and we practiced the question, how do you spell? How do you spell that word? Okay. So, for example, if I ask Emperatriz, 
Emperatriz, how do you spell your name, Emperatriz? What do you tell me? Try. Your microphone. M B. Uh -huh. No, no escucha muy bien. The spelling. How do you spell your name? ¿Cómo le trae su nombre? Emperatriz. Ay, es muy largo. <risa> <risa> try, try. Yo lo podía, lo anoté en la clase pasada, ya no recuerdo. <risa> ok, I'm gonna ask, I'm gonna ask somebody One second, else. please. Ok, ok, I'm going to ask another person, ok? Uh, let's see, let's see. Ever, how do you spell your last name? Rodríguez. R O D R I G U E C. Yes, that's right. Good, good. Very good. Sulma, how do you spell your name? Sulma. C U L M A. Correct. Very good. Pedro Tovar, how do you spell your name? P-E-T-E-R. D, D, oh, okay, okay, fine. You did it in English, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Eunice, how do you spell your name, Eunice? E-U-N-I-C-I. -E -I. E. C-E. Yes, very good. That's right. Francisco, what about your name? How do you spell your name? Algo largo. <laughs> Francisco, Francisco. Okay. F-R-A-N-C-I-S-C-O. That's right. Very good, Francisco. Good job, good job. So though that, that is the way in which we spell our names. Now to practice a little bit more the spelling. Now you have to ask your partners. Just let me share my screen. Give me a second. <clears throat> okay, so today's agenda, look very quickly. We're going to practice how do you spell the question. We're going to study positive adjectives and positive nouns. We're going to practice positive uh, reading activity, not for today, but for tomorrow, for the next class, I'm sorry, for the next class on Wednesday. But basically today we are going to study how do you spell positive adjectives and positive nouns. Now, the question is, how do you spell? Okay, how do you spell? So let's see, Francisco, Ask Pedro. Make the question to Pedro. Peter. Ask him. Francisco, Francisco. Ready? Just make the question. Solo hágale la pregunta a Pedro. How do you spell secretary? Just that. Pedro, how do you spell secretary? What happened? What happened? I think the connection failed. Okay, ask Francisco, ask Frida. Okay, Frida. How do you spell secretary? Hello, secretary S E C R E T A R way uh, way why why okay very good secretary thank you Frida ask ever ever for the uh, next word the next word let me show you the next word wait that one ever how do you spell objects 
Okay. Um, o, B, G, E, C, D, S. J. J. Sorry. Yes, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Thank you, Ever. Ever. Ask, let me see, Ever. Ask Moises for the word engineer. Moises, how do you spell, how do you spell engineer? Engineer. E N G I N N E R N E E R Okay Great thank you Moises ask let me see ask Rosa And the word is cell phone Rosa how do you spell cell phone Rosa Sanchez. <laughs> okay, okay. Somebody else. Let me see, Moises. Ask Irene. Irene, how do you spell cell phones? Hola, teacher. Eh, se me desconectó justamente ahorita, pero ya. Rosa. Hola. Rosa. Me está fallando bastante la señal. Ah, uh, ok, ok. Sí, ahorita sí. Eh, cell phone es... Sí, me escuchan. Yes, yes. Hola. Yes, lo escuchamos. Yes, ok. Es C E L L T H O M E Yes. That's right. Very good. Thank you, Rosa. And the last one is for Irene. Irene, how do you spell the word children? C H E L D R E N. Children, hmm, okay, okay. The spelling for the word is I. Okay. C-H-I, C-H-I, okay? C-H-I, okay. Yes, that's right. Okay, thank you, Irene. Good, good. Now, you guys, you have to select one word. Think of one word. Okay, a difficult one if you want to. Choose one word and then you will spell the word for everybody. And we are going to write the words in the chat of Zoom. Right now, think of one word. One word, for example, uh, I don't know, dentist, school, uh, people, children, whatever word. But you are going to spell the word for the class, okay? You will spell the word for the class and we are going to write it in the chat, okay? So, if you don't understand in Spanish, piensen una palabra, luego usted nos deletrea la palabra en inglés y nosotros vamos a escribir lo que usted deletree en el chat, okay? Think of one word, think of one word right now. But difficult, okay? No hello or house. Difficult one, difficult word. Hospital, parking lot, library, any kind of name, okay? Just think about that right now. Practice the spelling and you have two minutes. Two minutes to think about your word. En dos minutos empezamos a deletrar palabras, okay? Think of one word, think of one word. Eh, eh, excuse me, teacher. Eh, este, cada quien va a ir diciendo las palabras o usted va a ir diciendo quién va a ir. I, I will tell you, I will tell you, like Francisco, Frida, or oh, okay. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Think of one word. Right now, practice the spelling, okay? Practice the spelling. 
No, 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 no las escriban en el chat, no las escriban en el chat, no, no, no. Don't write them. Ustedes nos la van a decir oralmente. Los demás vamos a escribir en el chat. Ok. Don't write them, don't write. Ahorita no escriban en el chat, no yet. For example, I'm going to tell you my word. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to start. I will be the first one. Everybody in the chat, <clears throat> everybody in the chat. Number one, H. O, S, P, I, T, A, L. One more time. H, O, S, P, I, T, A, L. And the word is hospital. That's right, very good. What is it? <laughs> Chocolate. <laughs> Eric. <laughs> Chocolate, come on, come on. Hospital. Por eso, Eric, you are next. You're next. You have to spell your word. Okay. Okay. Spell your word for the class, Eric. Uh, T. 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 R. A. A. S. P. O. R. T. E. ¿Ah? Artritis, ¿o qué? <risa> Así escuché. T-R-A, hasta ahí me quedé. T-R-A, yeah, trust. Okay. Voy a repetir. T. Uh -huh. T. R. A. N. M. S. P. S. E. S. P. O R D E I don't know. Esto me salió. Artritis. Ahorita Voy yo, voy yo, teacher, con... You next? Okay, transport. <laughs> What is the word, Eric? Solo... Transportation or transport? Transport. Ah, okay, okay. Transport. Okay. Transport. 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 O T O O T O R Lo voy a volver a repetir. Repeat, repeat. Okay. O T O R R R I M O Ahí estamos. Lo voy a dejar hasta ahí. Otorrino. Otorrino. <laughs> What is the word? Otorrino. Only one R. 
me faltó, me faltó una, una R, ¿cierto? <risa> ok, 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 good, very good, very good. Ok, just one person, Moisés. Who is next? Who's next? Just one girl. Um, one girl. Frida. Ok. Ok. Let me see, let me see. Uh, B. U. S. I. N. E. S. S. Is that word correct in the chat? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good business. Next, another girl, Frida. Um, let's see. Eunice? Okay. E? A? A? U? G, H, T, E, R. Do you want to listen again? D, okay, okay. A, <clears throat> U, okay. G, H, T, E, R. Right. I don't know. Mm -mm, let me see. Huh, we have two words. Look. Daughter or teacher. Daughter or teacher. What is the word? What did you say? Daughter. Daughter. Yes. Okay. Daughter. That's right. Um, Okay, good. That, that one was kind of difficult. Yeah. Okay, good. Only said, choose one boy. Ever Alexander, eh, Moisés. No, Moisés already talked. No, no. Francisco. Ever. Okay. Okay. Eh, a. C. A. D. E. M Y <laughs> Is that correct? Yes, it's correct. Yes, very good. The academy, academy, academy. Next, ever who's next? Mm, we have Rebecca. Rebecca. So, okay. Go ahead, Rebecca. G. What? R G G R A N D M O T H E R Oh Grandmother? Yes. <laughs> Look what I got. Just a little thing. <laughs> okay, thank you, Rebecca. Good. Sulma, tell us the next word. Um, w E E K E N D. W E E. Mm -hmm. Weekend? K E N D. Right. The weekend. Good, good. Yes. Irene, tell us one word. C O E O S I M S. Yeah. 
for you. Cozy. Uh -huh. Cozy. Uh -huh. In plural. Uh -huh. Okay, great. Francisco, your turn. Thank you, Irene. Now, Francisco. Okay, okay. You want... uh, a. C. Uh -huh. C. Uh -huh. O. Uh -huh. U. N. T. A. N. T. Okay, very good. Accountant with double C. Good, good. Let me see who, who hasn't talked. Emperatriz. Hello. Yes. Okay. Um, ¿Y? ¿Me escuchan? ¿Y? 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 ¿W? ¿W? ¿P? No. No, no. Repeat. Again, again, yeah. ¿Y? ¿M? ¿P? E R A T R I C. Yes. Sí. <laughs> <laughs> Your name you En piretras. <laughs> What happened, Francisco? What happened? Para emprendérmelo. <laughs> good, Emperatriz. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay, really good, Emperatriz. <laughs> Miren, Francisco le cambió el nombre. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Good, good. So now, we have been practicing the spelling. We have been practicing the spelling of names. Uh, by doing it here in the class, right, one by one. But now you're going to listen. You're going to listen to somebody spelling some names. So just let me see if I can share this. Hmm. Just let me see something. <clears throat> Uh, okay well we are going to use we are going to use the chat continue using the chat and i'm going to share with you an audio a recording okay and you are going to hear some people spelling some nouns Okay, so let's see number one. Let's practice number one. You will hear somebody spelling some nouns. So in the chat, write. Write the word in the chat. Listen. G-I-R-A-F-F-E. This one is really fast. Really, really fast. I'm going to repeat it one more time. <laughs> G-I-R-A-F-F-E. F, F, E. One more time. I'm going to do it three times, okay? I'm going to repeat it three times. G, I, R, A, F, F, E. <laughs> Let's see the different answers. No. <laughs> okay. No. Very, very close. One more time. G I R A F F E. Ah, okay, okay. Look. Yes, that's right. Giraffe. 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 The animal. Yes. Giraffe. Good, good. I'm going to write it. Giraffe. G I R A F F E giraffe. Number two, I'm gonna repeat it three times. Okay. 
F O X E S O X E S F O X E S F O X E S Okay So F O X E S Number three. R I C H. R I C H. R I C H. Okay, very good. What is this spelling? Let's see. R I C. H. Good. Very good. Number four. C R A Y O N S. Again. C R A Y O N S. C R A Y O N S. <laughs> Cryons. Cryons. That's right. Cryons. Next. C H E R R Y. C H E R R Y. C H E R R Y. Yay, very good. Cherry. Cherry, that is the word. And the last one. I N S E C T. I N S E C T. One more time. I N S E C T. Okay, good, 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 very good. Insect, that's right. Okay, so let's see. Sulma, how do you spell giraffe? G-I-R-A-F-F-E. -F -F -E. Very good. Oscar, how do you spell foxes? <laughs> F O X. Foxes. Foxes. F O X. E S. E F. Sorry. Yeah, the plural. Okay, thank you. Uh, Rebecca, how do you spell rich? The microphone. Hello. Hello. Rebecca? The microphone is... Yeah, now yes. Rich. Yes. R A is rich. rich. H T. R R I E I R R A S T A little bit different, a little bit different. R I C H 
R A R I I I R I S C C C C C H C H yeah C H Okay, thank you, Rebecca. Thank you, thank you. Let's see, Francisco. How do you spell crayons? Crayons. Yep. C R A Y O N S. That's right. Thank you. Ever, how do you spell cherry? Your microphone is mute. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Um, C H E R R uh, Y. Yes, very good. Thank you. Frida, how do you spell insect? I N S E C T. That's right. Very good. Thank you. Okay. So, with this exercise, we finish the practice of the alphabet. We finish the practice of spelling. So, now your homework is to practice. Practice the alphabet as many times as you can. Spell different names. Practice. Practice the alphabet because that is an important topic. <clears throat> now, we're going to continue. We're going to move on. And we will work on the next topic. And what is the next topic? It is about possessive, possessive adjectives and possessive nouns. But I want you to look at the screen right now. If you see my screen, it says, which of the following words refer to objects? And we have different words. Can you read the different words? Um, let me see, help me, Roberto, Melara, help me with the different words here. Word. Read, read all the words. Uh, Mary, cell phone, car, computer, Jennifer, actor, television, accountant, book, helmet, maintenance, uniform. Uniform. Thank yes, that's right. Thank you so much. Maintenance, uniform, cell phone. You see, we have different, different words right here. Now, Tulma, give me an example of an object. What is an object? Cell phone. Cell phone, okay. Eunice, another object that you can see? Book. Book, okay. Irene, another object? Helmet. 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 Okay, good. Eric, another object? Computer. 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 Alexander, another object? Television. Television, okay. Moises, another object? Moises, Moises. Uh, Emperatriz, another object that you observe? Car. Car. That's right. Those are objects. Helmet, book, television, computer, cell phone, car, yeah. uniform. The other words refer to something different. Mary is a noun. Actor is a profession. Jennifer is a noun. Accountant is a profession. Maintenance is a profession. And here we have objects. Now, when we talk about objects, we can talk about possessives, possessive adjectives, possessive nouns, because we are going to talk about possessions, my possession, your possessions. So, look at this. We use possessive adjectives. Can you help me, Emperatriz, with the first one? So. Mm -hmm. Sometime belong to somebody. Yes. For example, that's a horse. My car is very 
Ay. Old. Very old. Es que tenía el chat habilitado. Ah, ok. <laughs> ok, ok. So, look, we use possessive adjectives to show something belongs to somebody. To show. Belongs. Yes, belongs. Le pertenece a alguien. Para demostrar que algo le pertenece a alguien. Possessions, right? Possessions. That our house. Our house, right? And then it, it is a possession. Not your house. It's our house. Okay? My car is very old. My car. Look, this is the possessive. My and then the object or the possession. My car. No, your car. Uh, not his car, but my car. Pedro, help me with the second use, please, of positive. Um, for relationship and friends, um, possessive is my mother is a doctor. Okay, the other example? Okay, we have two examples. Look, my mother is a doctor. How old is your sister? In this case, we're not talking about possessions, but we're talking about relationship. Relationships and friends. My friend, your friend, her friend. So, in this case, the possessive is, the possessive adjective is my. My. And then the relationship, right? Or in the other case, we have your, and then the relationship, your sister. My teacher, my students, okay? Our class, your class. This is your class. This is my class. The next one. Can you help me please, Moises, with the next one? The third use. Um, for parts of the body, eh, no alcanzo a ver la parte de abajo. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Uh, you can see the examples, no ve lo, los examples, los ejemplos. Eh, quiero ver, espera. Okay, okay, no, I'm going to no, read no. the examples. Okay, that's fine. The example number one says, she's washing her hair. She's washing her hair. Parts of the body. Hair, hair. Pero hair es como de él, ¿verdad? For a girl. Hair is for a girl. Ah, perdón, de ella. Ajá, yeah. su cabello. O sea, sería yeah. her hair. Hair, hair. Mm -hmm. If I mention a man or a boy, I'm going to say his, his hair. Uh -huh. eh, la, la otra dice I need uh -huh. to clean my ¿Cómo se pronuncia eso? Teeth. Teeth. Yeah. Eh, en este caso sería my teeth. My teeth. My teeth. Yes. Possessive adjective and then part of the body or body part. Es todo lo que se refiere a lo que uno tiene como posesión, de lo que uno es dueño, por así decirlo. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly, exactly. We're talking about possessions. That's right. That's why I asked you at the beginning about objects. Oh, what are the objects? Which word, which words refers to objects? Because we're talking about possessions. But not only objects but also relationships and also parts of the body. In those cases, we're going to use positive adjectives. My husband, my boyfriend, your family, your boss, relationship and friends. So we have a different positive adjective depending on the subject, depending on what you're talking about. The subject pronoun is 
I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. But now, possessive adjectives, look at the possessive adjectives, are a little bit different. The possessive adjective for I is my. The possessive adjective for you is your. He, his. She, her. It, its. This it's with no apostrophe. Look, no apostrophe. We, our. You, your. And they, their. So depending on the subject, I mean, it depends on the subject, the possessive adjective you're going to use. Okay? So, what is the possessive adjective for I? My. My. Very good. My. For you? Your. 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 For he? His. His. For he? Yeah. Her. 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 It. 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 We. It. Our. 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 You. Our. Your. 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 They. 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 She. 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 I. My. 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 We. My. Our. 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 They. What? They. 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 It. Is. It. 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 Okay, Oscar, help me with example number one. I and my in the examples. The number one. I one and my. Of, ah, I have a shirt. Uh -huh. I have a shirt. Yep. Next, Her. my. I have <coughs> my shirt is oh, green. Shirt. Exactly. Wait, wait. Thank you. Thank you very much. I have a shirt. My shirt Honey. is green. Pedro, help me with the next one. You and your. Pedro Tobar. Peter. Um, hola. Hello. Hola. Hola. Yes, Pedro. You have a book. Mm -hmm. Your book is new. That's right. Thank you. Emperatriz. He and his. Hola. Hola. Yes, he. Pedro. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Emperatriz. He and his. He has a pile of his pile of apes out. Soft. It's soft. Yeah. The pronunciation is pillow. 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 Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Pillow. Thank you. She has a pillow. His pillow is soft. The pillow is the object that you put where you put your head to sleep. The pillow. Almohada. Yes. That's right. Almohada. That's right. That's right. Okay, uh, help me please, Frida, with the next one. She and her. She has a dog. Her dog is small. Very good. Thank you. Rebecca, help me with the next one, please. It. It has a bone. Mm -hmm. Its bone is all. That's right. Thank you. Ever, help me with the next one, please. We and our. We have a beard. Our beer is noisy. That's right. Thank you. Eunice, help me with the next one. You and your. You have a house. Hmm? Your house is big. Correct. And uh, let me see. Irene, help me with they and their. They have a car. 
their car is slow. Thank you very much. Very good. Okay, so if you see, guys, on the first column, we have the subject pronoun. So you have you, and then you have a verb. You have, she has, she has, it has. You, and then a verb. He, and then a verb. Okay? On the other side, we have the possessive adjectives. So we have his hair, his pillow, his, and then we mention an object, his pillow. Her dog. A dog is not an object, but it's like, we're talking about a pet, right? We're talking about a pet, una mascota. So my pet, your pet, her dog, my dog. It's bun. We have the possessive and then we have the object. Bun. Bun means hueso. Bun means hueso. Our bird. Again, we are talking about an animal and we are talking about the possession. Okay. Who is the owner? Quien es el dueño? Who is the owner of the bird? And positive, so positive adjectives are used when we talk about possession. It can be an object, it can be about relationships, or it can be about body parts, a body part. Okay? So, do you understand how positive adjectives are used? Do you have questions about positive adjectives or it's clear? I have a question, teacher. Yeah. Tell me. Uh, why use has um, with he, she, and it? Good question. Good question. Good question. Okay. As you can see, they are talking, we are talking about possessions, right? Okay. When we talk, when we talk about possessions, normally we use the verb have. To have, right? I have, I have a car. However, in this case, the verb have has a conjugation in the simple present and you can use have or has. What is the difference? You are going to use um, have for the subject. I have, you have, okay. they have, we have, okay? But then if I talk about a woman, then is she has. For the men, he has. And for an object, it has. This is like a conjugation. A conjugation of the verb to have. Okay, thank you. Yeah? Okay? So basically, that's the difference. The subject. The subject, subject. Okay. So it is not possible to say he, he has. has, for example. That is not possible. But we use a has. And this is something that we are going to study in the unit number two, the plural form of the verb when we talk about he, she, and it, how the verb changes. Yes, but good question, good question. Okay, any other question? No more questions? No, you can tell me in the chat, no teacher, no questions. <laughs> or no. Moises, no sé qué tiene la compu. Oh my God. You can restart, Moises. Puede, puede eh, restart or reload the website. Refresh the website. Re okay. Ah, ya puedo hablar. Yeah, okay, Moises. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Cool. Okay, so possessive adjectives. Now, we are going to practice the possessive adjectives. And I'm going to share with you this exercise or this website so that you can practice. I'm going to give you a couple of minutes. I'm going to give you like five minutes, okay? Five minutes to work on this exercise online. Go to the chat, please. Go to the chat and then open the link to practice possessive adjectives.
once you open the link, you will be directed to this website. It says possessive adjectives. Complete the sentences with the correct positive adjective. Look at number one. Tim's got a mobile phone. Mobile phone is cool. So we are talking about Tim. So what is the positive adjective if I'm talking about a boy? I, you, uh, my, his, his, her. What is it? His. His. Exactly. His. Because I'm talking about Tim. Okay. It's a boy, so I use his. Number two. I have got a hamster. I keep hamster my. in the house. My. Exactly. My, because I'm talking about, I mean, I am using the subject I. So I keep my hamster in the hole. Number three, Susie and Tom are playing, are playing. Puppets are funny. Susie and Tom. They. There. Oh, okay. There. There. Number four. Look at number four. We're Tess and Johnny. We have we have just got we we're talking about my husband and I. We are we are Tess and Johnny. Ours. Ah, okay, very good. Our key. Continue with the rest, please. You have five minutes. Continue with others. You have five minutes. When you finish, click on this part. Click on here when you finish. Hi, Max Lewis. Hable, mi amor, no hay problema. Ok, let's check the attendance for today. Say present, please. Aguilar Emperatriz. Emperatriz, Emperatriz. Eh, 
Carlos Aquino. Present. Thank you. Isabel Blanco. Todos están en mute. Presently. Ah, okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Rebeca Cabrera. Rebeca. Present. Thank you very much. Oscar Castro. Present. Thank you. Present. Roberto Funes. Paul, in your light this morning, porque su mises, mises, ¿qué quiere decir mises? Su señorita, mises, perdió el bus, perdió su bus, o sea, Paul, in your, es all. ¿Qué? Perdió su bus. Teacher también. Relax, relax. Es que hay, hay dos, dos, no hay dos alumnos por uno. <risa> ok, le, we, we, um, ¿dónde me quedé? ¿Me quedé? Oscar, Robert Funes y Kevin. Kevin is not here. Moisés Guzmán. Present. Thank you. Moisés Guzmán. René Antonio is not in this class. Zulma López. Thank you, Zulma. Raúl Martínez. Present. Thank you. Eunice Mejía. Present. Thank you. Frida Mejía. Present. Thank you. Francisco Morales. Present. Thank you. Eric Quinteros. Present. Thank you. Eve Rodríguez. Present. Thank you. Rosa Sánchez. Rosa, 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 you're not here. Okay, but she was here. De aquí estaba Rosa. Pedro Tobar. Pedro is not here either. Okay, okay, okay. So, finish the exercise. Oh, oh. Yes. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. teacher. Present. Ah, okay. Thank you. I'm here. I'm here too. <laughs> Roberto Melara. Roberto, no tiene historia en Schoology, es cierto. O oh, sí. Yes, teacher. Sí, sí tiene, sí tiene. <laughs> But I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> Are you here? Ay, aquí. No, pero no es Roberto Funes. Él es, él es Oscar. No. Es este Kevin. Mm. Bueno, ahora lo, 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 lo vamos a poner acá. Yes, ¿Quién me, quién me habla? ¿Quién eh, habla? Yo. Yes, yes. Could you give you a key to know what the adjective is? A key to know what the adjective is, the possessive adjective. Could you give you a key to know what the adjective is? What the possessive adjective is? Ah, correct. It's correct. Okay. A key. A key. Okay. In this exercise, Moises, the key is, let me show you, the key is in the first sentence. We have two sentences in most of the examples. There are two sentences. For example, in the first one, it says, Teams got a mobile phone. This is the sentence number one. Teams got a mobile phone. Sentence number two, his mobile phone is cool. Now, how do you know that is his 
and no my and no your and not her. I know I'm going to use his because the principal subject or the principal person in this sentence is Tim. And I'm talking about Tim. And Tim is like saying he. So I'm talking about Tim. I'm talking about the boy. Then the object mobile phone refers to this person, which is Tim. That's why you know that you have to use his. Look at number two. In number two, we have two sentences. One more time. I got a hamster. I keep my hamster in the hole. Look, two sentences, but look at the sentence number one. The principal subject or person in this case is I. And I'm talking about an animal, right? And then I keep the hamster. But who is the owner of that hamster? ¿Quién es el dueño de ese hamster? The owner is me, right? The owner is me. So I can say I keep my hamster in the hole. No your hamster. No her hamster, my hamster. Because I'm talking about this hamster and I'm talking about me. I, okay, I got a hamster, I keep my hamster in the hole. It's for the subject. It depends on the subject in this case. It depends on the subject, mm -hmm. on the mm -hmm. first sentence. In the case of number three, Moises, what are the two sentences? Eh, está hablando de Susy y Anton. Exacto. Sea, de, de, de ellos. Ah, ok, ok. Ok. Yes. Sería they. They. Si yo quito Susy y Anton, sería they. Ok. Uh -huh. They are playing. So, what is the possessive adjective? They. They. Exactly. They're. 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 Mm -hmm. Their puppets are funny. Ok, ¿por qué there? Porque no estamos hablando de mis puppets, ni de sus puppets. Estamos hablando de los puppets de quién? De Susy. De Susy Anton. Tom. Exactly. Exactly, exactly. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. You're welcome. It's a pleasure. Ok, in number five, look at the picture. Hi, Matt. Does computer work? What is the positive here? Your. Ma. Does your. Mm. Does your. Uh -huh. Does your computer work? Por qué your? There is a, there is a girl. Porque se está refiriendo a, a Matt. Exactly. Le está hablando. Chele a le está hablando a Matt. Yes, le está hablando a Matt. Exactly. Hi, Matt. Does your computer work? Direct question, right? Very direct. Good. Number six. The lions in the zoo have a big cage. It's always locked. The lions, plural. The lions. So, what is the positive? It. Hey. It's the, plural. It's a plural noun. Lions. The. The ellos. De ellos, de ellos, exactly, de, de ellos. ellos. So, we're going to use there. Now, something important to mention yeah. here is this. Yeah, yeah, we are talking about animals. There. We are talking about animals. True. But now, if I talk about one animal, just one, I substitute the name or the noun in this case with the word eat. But if I talk about two, three, or four, or more animals, I'm going to use they to substitute the noun. Let me show you. 
something. Let me show you something. Okay. Imagine that I have something like this. The dog is mm, big. The dog is big. I want to substitute the dog. So I'm going to use the subject pronoun it is big. Okay? Look. It is big. But I am talking about one animal, just one. The dog is big. But if I talk about more than one dog, I'm going to say the dogs are big. So I'm not going to say it is big. Now I am going to say Dave. they are big. I am talking about two or three animals. Okay. Do you see the difference? Eat and day. So we can use day. We can use day for plural nouns. And the nouns can be animal. Mm -hmm. It can be people or objects, even objects. If I talk about an object, it can be something like my computers are new. I can say they are new. And I'm talking about the computers using they. Okay? Do you understand it? Yes? No? Yes. Okay, so I can use they for people, animals, objects, but plural, plural nouns. Okay, plural, plural. That's why, that's why we have in number six, the lions, the lions in plural. Their cage is always locked. Number seven, my best friend's name is Jack. My father. His father. I'm, I'm talking His. about my friend. Uh huh. His father. You. His. 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 Because I'm talking about my friend. And who is my best mm, friend? Your, your father. Who is my best your, friend? Your father. Your father is a dentist. Your father is a dentist? Mm -mm, no. Look at the sentence number one. Sentence number one. My best friend's name is Jack. El nombre de mi mejor amigo es Jack. Su padre es dentista. Exactly. Su padre es dentista. So, his father. Su padre, estamos hablando del padre de mi amigo. His father. His father is a dentist. Number eight. This is my mom's cat. Okay. Fur quiere decir pelaje. O sus pelitos, sus deditos. It's, It's gray. Okay. It's gris. They... What is it? What 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 are we talking about? What are we talking about? We say it. 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 Exactly. It's because I'm talking about the cat, right? We're talking mm -hmm. about the cat. Its fur is gray. Su, pel su pelo es gris. Su pelaje es, es gris. Number nine. Ana plays the piano. Piano is new. 
What is it? Mm, hair. 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 Ah, okay, hair. Good. Is, We are talking is. about Anna. Her piano is new. Her de ella. Su de ella, right? Number 10. Mm. We live uh, in a uh, hut in the center of the town. What is oh, it? Our. Oh. Ah, okay. Our flat is small. We are talking about our. We, we live, right? We live. Number 11. I got a new bicycle because it is my birthday. My birthday. My birthday. Number 12. Can you help me, please, Frida, to read number 12? Peter and Tom likes skateboarding. They are have. These are. I don't know. They are. We are, they. Talking, they are. We are talking about Peter and Tom. Uh -huh. You. No. Mm -mm. You. They. 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 Yes. We are talking about. Peter and Tom. A mí me quedó la duda de, de gato. El gato. <laughs> okay, tell me. Que no, 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 no entendí por qué. ¿Por qué it? Uh -huh. Okay. Porque aquí dice, este es el gato de mi mamá. Okay. Uh -huh. Y luego dice, fur is gray. Y fur quiere decir pelaje. Okay. Entonces, o sea, se está, ya después empieza a hablar de su pelaje, es decir, del pelaje del gato. Exacto. Ya no hace referencia tanto al sujeto inicial. No se Por refiere eso, a la mamá. Uh -huh. Ajá. Allá depende del caso, no depende del sujeto. En realidad, en la primera oración, el, la, de, a, de quien se refieren principalmente, a quien se refieren principalmente es al gato, porque ella dice el gato de mi mamá, the cat. Siempre estamos hablando del gatito. In the first sentence. Thank you. Okay, great, great. In number 12, we are talking about Peter and Tom. Peter and Tom, a Peter y Tom le gusta andar en patineta. Estas son sus patinetas. Sus patinetas. They're skateboard. Hablando de Peter and Tom. Number 13, Ever, can you help me please? Um, you got your your the complete sentence your camera your camera hello mr thomas have you got your camera have you got your camera yes have you got es otra forma de decir eh, tienes tienes ya tienes tu cámara tienes tu cámara this is another way to use have or have have got to have got and then the object sorry number 14 eunice do you want to try number 14 our english teacher has bought a new car mm -hmm. its color is red its color is red very good we are talking about the car, right? We're talking about the car. Its color is red. Number 15, Francisco Morales. <laughs> My friend Sara is on holiday with... We are talking about Sara. Bye. Her. Her. Familia sería her. Hola, Ana. Yes. Her family in Greece. In Greece. In Greece. In Greece. Yes. In this one, we are, thank you, Francisco, we are using her because we are talking about Sara, right? Sara está de vacaciones con... Su familia, with her family. 
talking about Santa. Okay. Number 16. Um, Irene, do you want to try number 16? Eric and my brother are studying. Eric and my brother. Okay. No, Claire, perdón. His, his. Ah, Eric and his. Eric and his brother. Ah, okay. Good. Very good. Eric and his brother. We are talking about this boy, right? This is Eric. This is his brother. Uh -huh. And they both are students. Yes. Eric, number 17. He can help you with score. How many words do you work it? I can help you with scores. Five. Five. My. My, yo, my, with my homework? My. Your. 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 That one. Hey, hey, Eric, I can help you with your homework. Do you want it? Te puedo ayudar con tu tarea. I can help you with your homework. Look. That is number okay. 17. Your, your, I, I offer my help to you. I can help you with your homework. Okay, number 18. Anybody, any volunteer, number 18. My husband and I have two children. Our children are twins. Okay, very good. Our children are trained. Number 19. This is Jeremy's calculator. He likes his hair. It hair. Is. Okay, it's. okay. Shape means uh, figura. Su figura o su, su forma. It's shape. Ah, okay. He likes. A él le gusta. It. 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 Very good. It's, it's shape. It's. Very good. It's shape. Good, good, good. Number 20. Colin, you are late um, this morning because you missed. There. There. You. There. There. Paul. But look at the there. chocolate. Paul and you. Paul Oof. and you. Oh. Oh. I said, yeah, Paul and I. Oh. Jur. Exactly. Very good. Very good, Ever. Yes. Paul and you are late this morning because you miss your bus. You are, you are talking about Paul and you. Ustedes. Ustedes, niños. You too, right? So you miss your bus. Number 21. Anne is 21 years old. What is next? Hair. 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 Hair is beautiful. Exactly. Her hair. <laughs> Her hair is beautiful. 22. The giraffe. The giraffe life. It. In Africa, it. Ah, its okay. neck is very long. Its neck is very long. Good. Number 23. That reads. She's need newspaper. Newspaper. Every morning. Okay, very good. Number twenty-four. Our neighbor, Mrs. Brown, likes her garden a lot. Her garden a lot. Thank you. Okay, just let me check the capital letters or check. Hello. Hello. La número 22. Sí, ya. Yeah. Bueno, yo puse it, pero me salió mal. Que salía como rojito. Le puso, uh -huh. lo puso en mayús, inicial mayúscula. Yes. It. Sin apóstrofe. Yes. Mm. The giraffe lives in Africa. The giraffe lives in Africa. 
its neck is very long. Y solo se refiere a una. But it's an animal. Si se refiere a un animal, solo uno, tendría que solo ser eat. Let's see. Sí, ya van a ver que varias me van a salir malas porque la mayúscula o por punctuation. Yeah, it's true. Here. A mí también me lo corrige como there. Y de 10 nos pone, miren, look. 10 out of 10. Okay. The correction? ¿Se la pone como? Como oh, there. There. Ah, yeah. uh, ok. There. Pero me, me, me tira 10 de 10. Igual. También. Mm, por eso, porque quizás porque le podemos poner there también. Their neck is very long. O sea que si le ponemos there, es como que les estuviéramos hablando de todas las giraffes. Todas las grafas, right? Oh, yeah. maybe, maybe that's why. Tal vez por eso sea, porque se habla de forma general. There. Okay. However, however, in this case, we are talking about one giraffe. About one. Estamos hablando de una jirafa, así que it's. It's. it's Podemos utilizar it's. it's. Ajá, porque solo estamos hablando de una. Pero ya si hablamos de muchas, de todas las jirafas, Ahí sí vamos a poder utilizar their, their neck is very long. And look at the others, look at the others. Very good job, good, good, good job. Look, all of them are correct. Todas están buenas. Just that one is the correct, has that correction. Obviously, we are going to continue studying this topic. Vamos a seguir viendo lo de los possessive adjectives, definitely. So, I need to, to review this part more. To, to review, of course, to review this. Tomorrow we don't have classes, right? We have classes until Wednesday. So, practice, practice positive adjectives. Practice this topic. So, on Wednesday we are going to practice positive adjectives as well. I'm just going to give you a short introduction. Two positive nouns. Pueden ver mi presentación de PowerPoint. Yes. 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 Okay. 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 So, positive adjectives is what we studied today. The next class we are going to study possessive nouns. Possessive noun. And possessive nouns are the ones that have the apostrophe S, okay? Like, for example, that Mark jacket, the dog's leaf, the government's plan. Look, we are going to study the possessive nouns the next class, but this is for the next class. We're going to continue talking about possessive. For the moment, we studied possessive Adjectives, right? So let's remember the possessive adjectives very quickly. The possessive adjective for I is, what is it? My. 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 Okay. My. For you. Your. 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 He. 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 Is. He. Is. He. 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 Your, 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 your. 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 Great. So remember, when we, use when we use possessive adjectives, we are going to mention the possessive adjective and then one possession. Possessive adjective and one object. Possessive adjective, one object. Possessive adjective, an animal in this case. Possessive adjective, an object. Possessive adjective, an animal again. Possessive adjective, an object or a possession. And possessive adjective, an object or a possession. This is how you use possessive adjectives. Okay? So we talk about possessions specifically. Do you have questions about this topic? Or no questions? No. 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 No.
¿Hasta qué horas podemos subir las tareas? Eh, ah, yo me acaba de falta uno. De misil en misil. No me recuerdo de haberle puesto hora, pero alguien me dijo de que ya le salía como que ya era entrega tarde. Alguien creo que me mencionó algo sobre eso. Entonces, la puede subir todavía, solo que le va a decir late, creo. Le va, okay. le va a dar un mensajito de late. Así que lo que voy a hacer es cambiarle la fecha de entrega nada más. Okay. So everybody, uh, everybody, please upload the homework. Please, please. We finished for today, guys. Thank you so much. I hope you and your day off you, you grow. Happy Independence Day. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Bye. teacher. Welcome. Bye. 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 Bye, bye bye. See bye, you on bye. Wednesday. See you on Saturday. On oh, Wednesday, no Robert. <laughs> <laughs> okay, teacher. Roberto Melara, stay for a moment, please. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Roberto no tiene, no tiene. Hello.